Good morning. It is Wednesday around 8 o'clock. Um, we're just getting our morning started and um, it's been a long week. Darren's out of town, um, like I've said earlier, but he'll be back in town by the time y'all watch this. So, Tucker has barked every night, all night long. Won't shut the hell up. Um, and, I, and I guess with it just being colder or cooler, or called the animals are moving a little bit more I'm, at night I'm not really sure um, you'd think they would be snuggled down in there here put that up in their bed um, so he's just barking a lot and I'm sure it's either a coat or a raccoon or possum or whatever it is anyway I, I'd like to kill him and whatever he's barking at so I thought I would move Murray and put Tucker across the creek over there where we've moved him. And I did. You're gonna fall. And um, never thought, I mean, Murray bites, but he's not like this killer dog with other animals, I wouldn't, I didn't think. So we haven't totally got the chicken fence I mean it's done but we got to fix the gate so it latches and anyway he's he's good at um, opening gates if they're not latched or clipped and he did get the chicken duck gate open and he got a hold of one of my uh, white ducks and bit them like like this on top but I think I think he's gonna be okay uh, last night it was Uh, it was pretty upsetting. Just because, you know, you put the stupid dog back there and it's not your fault, but it is your fault. And I don't know, it, it was just, he was all bloody and he, his little wing is hurt. And I just felt bad. Um, so, anyway, besides being tired, from being up screaming at a stupid dog all night. Um, it, it was just emotional. It was not a fun night. So anyway, um, that's about it. I think he's gonna be okay. I brought him in last night, put some hay in my tub, which is so not what I'd like to do. But I wanted to keep him separated and a little warmer than what he would be outside because I really thought he was gonna die as much blood that was all over him. Um, so I put hay in the bottom of my tub and, and that's a potty chair, not a step stool. And, um, we will start potty training here in the next couple months, but he uses it as a step stool. So anyway, um, brought him in, put hay in the tub and let him stay there all night. He did eat and drink. So I thought, well, you know, I'll clean the tub out, and I've tried to wash his wings off because, I mean, one is damaged, um, and if I can keep the infection out of it, uh, he will be fine. I'm almost 100% sure. So anyway, I have a duck now swimming in my bathtub, which is so unsanitary, but I promise I will clean it and bleach it. You can see his boo-boo. Looks better. Um... I have put peroxide on it. What do you do? I, I mean, so I'm letting him kind of soak his wound, wounded wing and I'm going to put a towel on him and take him outside. I think with blood not being visible, I don't know much about chickens besides I eat a lot and they're pain in the ass. Um, maybe they won't pick on them. If they do, I will kick all the chickens and the other ducks out of the house and shut the door on it so they can't get back in there and let him have some rest time. That's the best I can do. Kind of hard as hell with this one right here. My crazy boy. Um, can you say good morning? No? Hey, Xander. He's wide open. Xander, look. Say good morning.
yeah, we're not going to get that either. So, Sam's still asleep. I had a doctor's appointment yesterday. He was also crazy in that appointment. Uh, good, but, you know, he's two. So, um, he was very good for a two-year-old, but very active. So, anyway, with Darren being out of town, it's just kind of, it's not going as smoothly as it usually does. And I'm just tired. I think that has to do with a lot of it. Um, but today we will have a good day because I'm going to throw that damn duck out. I'm going to clean up after him and then we're just going to have a low-key day. We may go to Walmart and grab a few things. Other than that, I'm not doing much of nothing besides cleaning up after the hey nasty I'm back. I got the, it's 9 o'clock. So it took me an hour, talked to Darren, FaceTimed him, let him look at the duck, and um, he thinks it'll be okay. I think she, she or he needs a little TLC for the next couple days. My plan is, what I did so far is I put all the chickens outside the chicken coop, and I left the three ducks that were out there in there and blocked it off so they couldn't get back out wasn't as easy as I just said it. It was a pain in the ass. Somehow the chickens kept running back in and I don't even know. But um, got that done. Got some peroxide on its little wing. Cleaned as good as I could. I mean, I don't want to touch it. I don't know really much about ducks besides they're loud and they stink. And, um, and they're cute. So I put that one out there. All four ducks are in the house. All 25 chickens are outside. My plan for this evening, so the chickens isn't with the wounded one, is I'm going to bring the chickens in. I'm going to put the ducks out. And I'm going to put a heat lamp on the outside of the chicken house, like right up against it, like clip to the fence behind the chicken house so they stay at the chicken house but they're not in it with the chickens. Or I could just leave all the ducks in and leave all the chickens out. Um, I don't know. It'll probably be easier to do the ducks because uh, I don't know. Chickens seem like they're little hothouse flowers. But anyway, I used, um, I got the duck out. I used the Fantastic with Bleach all-purpose cleaner. Uh, usually I use Comet and then spray it and let it sit in bleach. I've never used that before. Um, it worked great. All clean. Uh, scrubbed the walls, scrubbed everything. It is completely clean. Now I just got to, I'm going to go ahead and pull the rugs out and wash them and sweep them off in here also in the closet just to make sure there's because I do have some hay where I put hay in there because I felt sorry for the little critter um, and I mean I have some I gotta clean the sink and counters because I did set the pan that I had water in it on the counter so um, I'm gonna do that but I think the duck will be fine outside <laughs> if not you can only do so much um, I do feel bad but It is what it is, and I, I did the best I could. So anyway, um, he's out in the process of cleaning the bathroom and keeping this one out of there and happy. Can you say good morning? No? He's watching Toy Story. One of his favorite cartoon or movie, Disney movies. So he's got him some, I don't know why he drug out the coat hangers, but he did. Um, so I'm going to finish cleaning, get all that done, and hopefully be able to play with him for a little bit, because it looks like he's going to need a bath from eating breakfast. Can you, can you say bye? Tell him bye. Bye.